To say it's been a week to forget for Italian football would be an understatement. With the country's domestic game embroiled in match-fixing allegations, the Azzurri were looking to let their football do the talking in the build-up to Euro 2012. But having already lost to Uruguay and the USA, they then made it a hat-trick of friendly defeats with a 3-0 hammering by Russia on Friday. Defensive errors were the root cause as the Russians ran riot in the second half, scoring three goals without reply. But the uncertainty of the latest betting scandal seems to have affected the squad. Nevertheless, Italy coach Cesare Prandelli remained philosophical in defeat. We only have to see if this team right now can withstand high-intensity rhythms. When we have managed to attack the opposing team with a certain discipline, a defence made up of four players and a midfield structured in a certain way, then we have managed to take something from the game. But when we have lost the ball and they have had the chance to play in the wide areas, then the team has become disjointed. The match-fixing storm has already seen the Juventus head coach Antonio Conte come under questioning and Domenico Crescita removed from the final Italian 23-man squad. There had even been reports that the national team may have to pull out of the upcoming tournament itself as a result of the allegations. Yet Gianluigi Buffon says the team's performances on the pitch will not be affected by the batting scandal. I got to the pitch wondering what has happened this week. We've been under attack for a whole week. But I've had no problems with this because I'm always the same when I enter onto the pitch. The goalkeeper went on to suggest he has nothing to worry about. Investigators are allegedly looking at several bets he placed in 2010. I have nothing more to say on the betting scandal. We're talking about something for which I'm not under investigation. I haven't been interrogated. With my money, I can buy a number of watches. I can help a friend of mine to buy a field or a home. I can buy a painting or I can do whatever I want to. Maybe this is not acceptable in Italy. I don't know. If you want, I can tell you my current expenses. They'll need to put those issues to one side quickly. Italy kick off their Euro 2012 campaign against current champions and tournament favourite Spain on June 10th.